Welcome to the What's Happening Birmingham video podcast. Hello, everyone. This is Jarvis S. Scott with What's Happening Birmingham. I'm back again. Boy, time flies. Mr. Jarrell Jones with Renew Birmingham with the upcoming event coming up this Saturday called the Renew Birmingham Cookout Cookout and Car Show. show. (laughs) So there's something new this year you're doing with, Jarrell. Tell me about it. Right. Well, yeah, we want to do edutainment, not just entertainment. Mm -hmm. So um, everything that we do, the purpose is to create community cohesion. Mm -hmm. Uh, But you have to have things that are attractive to people. And, uh, you know, I've always been a fan of classic cars. I think everybody has some affinity, if it is just a glimpse. But, you know, adding that to uh, live entertainment and then free, everything, all the food is free, you know, we feel like we'll get more participation if the weather holds. Of course, we also have a tent this time, so they'll be shaded. We'll have, um, uh, what do you call it, misting fans. Uh-huh. Keep it cool. Uh, we have shaved ice or Italian ice. We have, uh, you know, cool water. So it, just to make the experience enjoyable, but the biggest thing is the message of putting the neighbor back in neighborhood. This past weekend has been tragic. And yeah. I think that, you know, if, if anybody who's conscious, it's on your mind. You know, when is our city going to, you know, change? And, and it's it's not government that can change it. It has to be the residents. So we're trying to get as many residents together as possible and to, to present the message that we can change the culture in our community. We can change these outcomes. But it's going to take more than, than, you know, just sitting back waiting for something to happen. So we want to help give people some strategies, um, you know, to help them understand what we're trying to do. As far as pulling businesses together, the Hensley Business Alliance will be highlighted, you know, um, in this, uh, at this event. We'll also have resource organizations there in, in District 9 that the City of Birmingham has have been really, really supportive, uh, giving us the ability to use a lot. Um, so everybody's trying to do their part in this case, and we want to pull more and more people, the residents in the community, to try to do our part for changing the culture and changing the outcome. Okay, and just in case people want to know where I'm at, I'm in downtown Inslee, as you can kind of see, and I like how they got the different artwork yeah. and, there, and, and, and everything. And um, like you said, I agree with you. It takes the residents to kind of make the change right, right. for it. Now, with the car show, are you doing, are they giving any prizes for the best car, or is it just more like a showcase, we'll like let, bring a car it's out? It's a showcase, but we'll let, definitely let the people choose who has the best car. I'll be giving $50 away to some participant, somebody who's registered to come okay. into the program. Every half hour, I'm going to give away $50. So that's another reason to come out. Yeah, yeah. That, that, at least it puts you in the gas tank, right? You know, so, um, yeah, but the, the idea is to uh, just have an enjoyable experience. It's not about the cars. It's largely about the people and how we interact with each other. Um, so we want to emphasize the message of putting the neighbor back in neighborhood. The truth is that if we really understood how to neighbor one another, how to be accountable and, and responsible to one another, as a grown man, I can't wake up in my community and hear about homicides and children being shot to death, and it not matter to me. And I think that the more this happens, you know, for some people, the more desensitized they get to it. But I don't think that that's the way we need to go. So we want to we want to be conscious of these things. And not only that, we want to be inspired to do what we can to change those outcomes. So while we're doing the Inslee yeah. Renaissance uh, yeah. Cookout and Car Show, Renew Birmingham Cookout and Car Show, that uh-huh. is not the emphasis. The yeah. emphasis is people getting together, being uh-huh. able to share time, share ideas, and share investment. Yeah, and then also people too. Don't worry, it's gonna be playing security. There's yeah. no people things outdoor yeah. event, but it's gonna be playing security. And just what you say, a chance to network and meet each other and just right. have a good old time before school starts back, I like to call it. That's right. That's right. And everything. Yeah. So for more information about the event, where can they go? You can go to renewbham.org. That's R E N E W B H A M dot org. Okay. The events tab. Right, and, and learn all about the event, but that website itself is filled with information. To understand what Renew Birmingham is, we're a collective impact organization. We have the ability to access for any resource uh-huh. in, the, in the city. There's some 400 nonprofit organizations, uh-huh. 700 churches. 
If you need a resource, we can get it to you. One stop shop. We only serve a small area so that we can saturate it, pull as many people into that as possible. But remember this that we don't just give services away unless you're debilitated. You must volunteer and make a contribution to your community. We feel like that's the best model that a nonprofit organization can have to change. We don't want to cripple people by causing dependency and giving them resources without accountability and responsibility. Mm. We want to empower people to be effective and residents that can be viable contributors mm. to their community so that we can change some of these outcomes. All right. Well, thanks for coming on today, Darrell. Um, you all, please come out this Saturday. Actually, I'll probably be coming out and shoot a little, little few, little, some footage out here sure. Saturday. Can I show you all the people that's around and stuff and have yes, a good time? 1801 Avenue, 18 yep. Angeles. If you want to call us, you can call us at 205-201-4275. Uh, and if you want to email us, in, email us at info at renewbham.org. That's for all the information that you can get for our Renew Birmingham. We'll be glad to see you out this weekend. Please come out, have a good time, and make your contribution to the advancement. All right. Well, thanks for coming on today. Thank you for watching. Please check out what's happening Birmingham.com for more interviews. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and check out the audio version of this on Apple Podcasts. Thank you all again, and see you all Saturday. Bye-bye. Thank you for watching the What's Happening Birmingham video podcast. Please check out our website app or subscribe to our YouTube channel for the latest videos today.